back student here i will summarize this what is uh, this ndfa minimization of ndfa with table filling method okay so here this is a graph is given by the in question based on this graph first we need to make a empty table empty table p and q okay empty table p and q so these are the methods four methods are there okay with the help of this four method we can do the table filling method first step draw a table for all pair of state p q p comma q not necessarily connected directly what does it mean means a is not directly connected to d a is not directly connected to e means it is not necessary that should be a connected directly okay that is a thing and here a b c d e a b c d e so i make a table and here why in this format because a comma b and b comma a will be same okay because of that diagonally we remove the upward upward table and diagonal so after that remaining we will get the empty for this next after this first of all you need to check the graph you need to check the graph and you need to mark the tick so what is the second condition consider every state pair p comma q is the t in the dfa where p belongs to f and q does not belongs to f or vice versa and mark them so what is the f here here f is a final state so come here here f is a final state is only one that is e and remaining are the remaining are the normal state so here we need to check we need to check from a to b a to b when it is going from a to b what is the connection a to b a to b the connection is there but a and b both are the non final state okay non final state but what do you what we need final state one final state needed and one normal state okay one final state needed or one non final state when it is together then only we need to mark in this table okay so just forget about the green okay forget about the green so i will do one thing i will erase this okay now a to a to b a to b is we don't have anything so leave that both are non final state c a c a c a and c both are the non final state okay next b c b c this b as well as c both are the non final state both are same so should not be tick a d a and d a and d they both are the non final state that also should not be mark db or bd bd this bd also both are final state uh, non final state so this also should not be mark here b and c sorry d and c d and c this both is non final state so that also should not be marked but in come to the e a e can you see a and e this is directly or indirectly it is not compulsory that there should be a connected so a and e e is a final state and a is a normal state this is different can you see here p is normal state and f is final state that means here we need to mark the tick a and e is mark the tick you can minimize this next b e b and e b is a non final state and e is a 
final state yes final and non final clear tick next c is a non final state and e is a final state so c e this is also okay next d is a non final state and e is a final state this is also okay Be as per this table we got the values we fill the table now what we need to do we need to select what are the empty boxes what is empty boxes a comma b a comma b here then a comma c and b comma c a comma d b comma d c comma d so this is six one two three four five six six so first thing delta same thing we need to apply here repeat this step until we cannot mark any more state after that p comma q comma marks it is a pair delta p comma a and q comma a a is nothing but string so here a comma 0 a comma 0 and b comma 0 we are taking this one okay we are taking this one a comma 0 b comma 0 a comma 0 where it is going a comma 0 is going to b and b comma 0 is where it is going is going to b only okay next now we have taken the input 0 now we will take the 1 a on 1 is going to c and b on 1 is going to d b on 1 is going to d c d just check it out c d is is it marked c and d no it is not marked okay leave it delta a comma 0 a comma 0 is b and c comma 0 is also b delta i am taking the second one a comma 1 is c and c comma 1 is c okay c comma 1 is also c okay next delta b comma 0 now i am taking this one okay b comma 0 is b c comma 0 is b how we are getting b comma on 0 what the answer we are getting b only c on 0 c on 0 where it is going is going to b only delta b comma 1 is d c comma 1 is c so c d c and d fine this is also not accepting next a comma 0 is b a comma 0 is going to b here a comma 0 is going to b and d comma 0 is going to b next if i take the input string 1 delta a comma 1 is going to c okay and delta d comma 1 is going to e so now we got the two state in two state one is a final state and another one is normal state that means we are accepting this okay we are accepting this so when you accept this what to do you need to go a comma d you need to go a comma d a comma d and mark the mark the tick mark the tick why because we are getting c comma e and already c comma e is marked here so that because of that we need to mark here okay next next is delta b comma 0 is b delta b comma delta b comma 0 is going to b and d comma 0 is also going to b okay this one next here delta b comma 1 with the input string 1 is going to d and delta d comma 1 is going to e so you have the e as well as d that means 
D and E. D is a normal state and E is a final state. That also will accept. So when you are getting D, E, so where we are getting B, D, B, T. Next, C comma zero, D comma zero. C comma zero, what is C comma zero? C comma zero, C comma zero. When the C on zero is going to D. D on zero is going to B. This is finished. Next. Next one is C comma one is going to C comma one is going to C only. D comma one, D comma one is going to E. So E and C, these both are different. Final state is E, non final state is C. This string also will accept and mark in the table okay so we finished here next if you need to repeat repeat the step until we cannot mark any more state so here we again take the new states what are the new remaining states are there a comma 0 sorry a comma b okay next one is what are the empty a comma b then a comma c b comma c a comma c and b comma c the remaining remaining three steps uh, three empty cell now again we need to do this a and b a comma 0 b comma 0 is going to b and b Okay, as per this table. Next, delta c comma one. Sorry, delta a comma one and b comma one. A comma one, where it is going? A comma one is going to c, and b comma one, b comma one is going to d. So answer is c d. But just go in the graph and check. C and d is marked. Is marked is nothing but. the mark is nothing but we need to mark a b we need to mark a b okay a b fine next next one is i am taking a c if you take a c then you will get the same value you need to perform the operation a c you will get c c and b b next one is next one is b c b comma 0 is on b c comma 0 is b b comma 1 when the b comma 1 is where it is going b comma 1 is going to b d and c comma 1 is going to c c comma 1 is going to c only so c and d c and d go and check in the graph c d is marked c and d is marked because of that we need to mark we need to mark b c b and c we need to mark b c b c okay so here we got now what is the remaining now only remaining is a comma c in a comma c we need to only one un unmarked box is there in the table okay so now now we need to check which one is a empty so here a comma c is left out a comma c so a comma c you need to combine together a comma c combine together then we will get the table so here here as per this a comma c okay this is a dfa and we are doing minimization dfa so here a c a comma c okay one circle one state and we have taken b we have taken d we have taken e now which one is the initial state you need to select and which one is the final state you need to mark here. 
start from this initial state from a on 0 is going to be a on 0 is going to be so I mark this next C on a on 1 a on 1 where it is going is going to C so here only loop then C on 1 C on 0 C on 0 is going to B C on 0 is going to B C on 1 is going to 1 only C only sorry so this is finished next go to the B B on 0 B on 0 where it is going is going to B only B on 0 is going to B only next B on 1 where it is going B on 1 is going to B on 1 is going to D B on 1 is going to D B is finished now C C on 1 C on 1 where it is C on 1 C on 1 is 1 only C on 0 is 0 so A B C so this is to finish now we will move to the next one D D on 0 is going to be D on 0 is going to be and D on 1 is going to E D on 1 is going to E next one E E on 0 E on 0 is going to be E on 0 is going to be and E on 1 is going to C E on 1 is going to C so this is your final answer final answer ok final answer is this minimization of DSA I hope you understand thank you very much